bless us. We ask you to be in Jesus' name. Amen. Provocative, inspirational, and changing. Inspiring, sharing, and invigorating. It's a community of respect for people's views and respect. When I first came across Germinate Leadership, what really excited me about it was the entrepreneurial aspect, the idea of releasing your creative and entrepreneurial gifts. So I think it's great that we're ministering to those who minister in the rural churches. The importance of all the leadership training in Germinate Leadership is that it is about the rural church. It's um, exciting, empowering and, and yeah, of, of the spirit, I would say. People are in a position out there, and, uh, and you know they, they, they want to be challenged and, and, and find you know other people who are interested in doing kind of innovative um, approaches to their ministry. Then I'd highly recommend it because it's a good place as well to kind of test out some of your ideas with other people and, and kind of you know chew the cud with them a bit as well. The deacon's role is clearly one of guidance and enabling. To actually hear somebody give their own personal experience, somebody who talks with authority and with actual acumen as well. And then to hear people that share their stories about their reflections can only feed me. So apart from me learning from my own parishioners, it's also learning from my peer group as well. Yeah. You really feel a blessing from being engaged and involved in this. We're all sort of bursting to, to talk, to tell our stories, to share. So I think that's, that's the beauty of it. I certainly believe that God was speaking uh, through the lecture and through people's contribution. And across the traditions too, that was lovely. And the, the lady who spoke about being between a bishop and a Baptist pastor, that was fantastic. Where she sat was how she operates. That was a lovely, lovely cameo of what we've been talking about. And, uh, again, this morning was a great illustration of how the wisdom is often in the room. That you're not bringing something in additional, it's actually collective wisdom that you're gleaning and bringing that understanding. So we're kind of like iron sharpening iron. We're, we're both learning and growing through the experience. And therefore it was important that the wisdom in the room should be shared rather than it come back to the front all the time. So that's what I was trying to model in the, in the dialogue. But it really took off, as you see. You feel sometimes isolated in the context that you are. And then you, you come to days like this and where people are asking the same questions. Often you get quite down and isolated and then renewed and inspired. So it's that, that kind of dynamic that I'm looking for, for from Germinate Lectures. I think a lot of the value of the course is getting together with other people in a similar context. And it can be quite lonely, quite isolated when you're in rural mission and ministry and getting together with like-minded people is a real encouragement. So today with people exploring issues around collaborative ministry and what that means for lay people, for clergy, uh, you know, it was helpful. It's a safe space where you can um, think through some quite hard issues that you couldn't necessarily think through with your um, you know, superintendent or bishop or equivalents. I think it's seeing the quality of the resource that Germinate Arthur Ank offer and seeing how leaders develop over time and I wanted to invest some of my time in that and offer the limited experience that I have for the guy who I'm mentoring at the moment. Now we've all got very different, um, different paths we've been on to this point um, but and yet we're all kind of sharing this journey together, it's, uh, yeah, it's a strength of the course. It's exciting and encouraging to be with an enthusiastic group of people who have been inspired and equipped for their mission and ministry and, and it's just a privilege to be with them. Whatever your journey has been, it would you know, it'd be the encouragers to walk with you on the journey and help you explore new areas. It's just it's um, exciting, empowering and, and yeah, of the spirit of it.